Hello and welcome to my rather geeky video on how to create a text based game using Python. Now, since this is going to be in part, hopefully, so you know, slowly eventually creating the text based game. So, the first part is going to show you how to create three definitions and create user inputs to start the game as it says over here um, so our first definition um, is gonna be start so what it says right at the beginning of the game so to make it say something we use print to bring something on the screen print um, welcome to the game created by Mr. Super Yoda Zero One Type Start to Begin. So, there we are, so that's just asking the user to type start to begin. And then, so if we start off this sequence, then it's just going to go, welcome to the game created by Mr. Super Zero one type start to begin. So, that's all good. But we want it to actually do something. So, if we go print to actually bring it on to the next um, definition which is going to be yep prompt star then we can actually start doing user inputs so prompt it's not going to be prompt star it's going to be prompt zero equals raw input make sure you spell it that way and make sure you have the um, hyphen or whatever it is type a type a command now this is you can type whatever you want in those brackets you don't even have to type anything but then you know the user won't actually know they have to type so by just saying type a command in a text based game that's suggesting to users that they can type whatever they want so and then if we go on to try so then you know if prompt zero equals so basically going if you typed in start then we can bring you on to outside house so that means that if you typed in start then it will bring you to the outside of the house which is what we're going to define next but we haven't finished this definition else if that's what elif means prompt zero equals begin then we can say the computer can say to us you need to follow instructions just to add a bit of humor to it 
print and then we can then we have to bring it back to the start of this coding module and then we just need to finish it off by else print so basically saying anything else you type in type start not that So just looping it back round then except value error make sure value error is spelt one word with um er with the e being capital A print type start not that print so that's our definition for prompt start so if we actually run that hopefully it will work welcome to the game created by Mr. CV to do one type start to begin now if we type start then it will say global name outside house not defined that's because we haven't defined it yet so but let's just make sure everything else is working properly so let's type begin you need to follow instructions it's good let's type type start not that so there we are so it's all working as it should and it's so it's coming up nicely so now we can do our final definition of part one which is outside house I'm not quite sure what this game is actually gonna involve yet I mean as I say this to actually like code it like this it's not gonna be a lot of stuff I mean we will add global variables so like you can type one thing and if you type it again then it comes up something different and you know we could have conversations with people inside the house I don't know, I haven't decided it yet, but let's just so this isn't gonna have this is gonna be a lot like the um start text the start definition. So it's just gonna print you are out side a nice looking house what do you do so that's all it needs to be don't even need that's that's actually all you know so if we run this again type type command type start to begin start you're outside a nice looking house what do you do so there we are it's all looking fine and dandy and this practically sums up my uh, part one of this tutorial so yeah thanks for watching guys and Hope you've learned something new.